To Mark Addison, the Indian Ocean is home. He lives on the east coast of South Africa, and there's hardly a day when he isn't in the water. No air tanks, no fancy equipment. Mark is a free diver. The only air he has is in his lungs, and he's able to hold his breath for an incredible six minutes. Once he's under the surface, Mark does something that most of us would find terrifying. He dives with sharks. You know, I've always joked that I will die poor, but with a wealth of experience. It's this cruel mistress syndrome that I see with the sea. It's a drug, it's hard to let it go, and it's tough. Everything is easier. Everything in life is easier than dealing with that ocean. But it's something you've got to come back for. It's challenging, it's interesting, it's, it, you learn so much, you feel so small. You're humbled by it, and on any given day, I would trade that for all the gold, all the silver. They're his passion. They're more than his passion. They are his everything. For 20 years, Mark's shark of choice to swim with and to get to know has been the tiger. I really love all the species of shark, and I think they're fantastic. But nothing is as beautiful as a tiger shark. The big black eye, the stripes, no other shark's got stripes like that. Mark has been able to study the tiger in a special way. Without the noise of air bubbles, the sharks don't shy away. He's tolerated, accepted. People talk about climate change, what does it mean? And, and it's been very difficult for us to, to translate these effects. It's a great challenge. We don't know what tomorrow is going to look like. And every day for me is a challenge to try and understand where this new world is taking us. Mark doesn't just dive with tiger sharks. He's trying to protect them. Everything he does is towards that goal. 